Hello, my name is Sanjeevni Mittal. I'm responsible for marketing to IT pros that are adopting Surface for their commercial businesses every day. For the next few minutes, I will go over some topics that commonly come up when you are selling Surface to IT pros. Surface 3 is perfect for those who prioritize portability over power. They are looking for a smaller device over a larger screen, and they really need a more affordable device and customers who are really looking for LTE connection. Surface 3 is a great device for them. For customers who are looking for more power and they are looking for larger screen, Surface Pro 3 is a great device for them. They are looking to replace their laptop with a tablet type functionality. They usually create content, they are multitasking all the time, and they tend to run demanding software that are high intensive on the processor. This table compares the technical specifications for Surface 3 and Surface Pro 3. Let's go through some of the key details here. Surface 3, just like Surface Pro 3, ships with Windows 8.1 Pro. Both the devices, Surface 3 and Surface Pro 3, are upgradable to Windows 10. A key point that you need to know is despite running quad-core Intel Atom X7 processor, Surface 3 runs 64-bit architecture for operating system, which means for your commercial customers, they can have one enterprise image that they can apply to Surface 3 as well as Surface Pro 3. It's really important to understand that there are two SKUs that are available for commercial customers for Surface 3. Four gigabyte, 64 gigabyte storage, and four gigabyte RAM with 128 gigabyte storage for Surface 3. And for Surface Pro 3, it's the same configuration that we have made available since its launch. Again, as a quick reminder, Surface Pro 3 runs the Intel Core i3, i5, or i7 processor. Now, this slide really compares some of the capabilities in Surface 3 and Surface Pro 3 devices. A common question that I get every day is whether or not Surface 3 includes a TPM. As a quick reminder, TPM really enables encryption and decryption of the device. Surface 3 and Surface Pro 3 both support TPM. There are some features that Surface 3 will not include right out the gate at the general availability timeframe. However, please note that these features and capabilities will be available soon after the general availability of Surface 3 device. Stay tuned for the timeframe for when these features will be available to Surface 3 devices. Deployment and manageability is a common conversation with the IT pros. The good news is Surface 3 and Surface Pro 3 can be deployed in exact same manner. Both devices are Windows 10 ready. They are both 64-bit enabled, which means you can have the same image run on both the devices. Surface 3 can be joined to the domain. And similar to Surface Pro 3, Surface 3 also will include regular firmware and driver updates. There will be an MSI package that will be available to ease deployment of Surface 3 devices, just like Surface Pro 3 today. And the best part, and this is a question that comes up with IT pros all the time, IT pros can use their familiar deployment tools like SCCM and Windows Intune to deploy both Surface 3 and Surface Pro 3 devices. In closing, here are some resources for you to use. And because these are customer-ready resources, you can even share them with your customers. A Couple of them that I do want to call out. The first one is the link to get the latest firmware and driver updates for Surface. You will be glad to know that the firmware and driver updates for Surface 3 will be delivered in exact same manner as Surface Pro 3 today. A key resource that you want to leave with your customers with is the Surface for IT Pros blog on TechNet. 
please use Surface Tech Center extensively with your customers to really help them address their technical issues. Thank you so much for watching today. I hope that was really useful. Happy selling.